hey y'all we're gonna do our deviled ham dip and I had a lot of people ask me to do this recipe so that's what we're gonna do it's on page two if you have our cookbook if you need our cookbook I'll put the link above this post and below and you can go ahead and get yourself a copy of that and everybody that's been asking about those Brussels sprouts I made that recipe is also in the cookbook if you have the cookbook so you're gonna need a half a pound of some kind of deli meat or ham I have these little ham cubes so I just um, weighed a half a pound of that and that's what we're going to use. So I have one small onion in here and we're going to start chopping that onion up just a little bit. Now we need a block of cream cheese which is eight ounces and we're going to stick that in there. The next thing we're going to need is our half a pound of ham and we are going to put that in here. And then we're going to start chopping this up again. We need two tablespoons of mayonnaise. There's one tablespoon. There's another tablespoon. We're going to add a quarter a teaspoon of black pepper. And you can add more if you like. Then we're going to add in some garlic powder. And we need one teaspoon of garlic powder. A half a teaspoon of onion powder and you can go to a quarter teaspoon if you want because there's a fresh onion in there and we need prepared horseradish but I have this horseradish sauce and that's what I'm going to use I'm just going to use a three actually one tablespoon just three teaspoons is a tablespoon of that in here and then we're going to mix this together. This is what it looks like. It's all nice and smooth. Now I'm going to go ahead and put it in a bowl. All right, y'all. So that's what it looks like. Again, when we first made this, we used the Black Forest ham. You can use whatever kind of ham you want for your own um, flavor and profile. You can add a little salt if you want, but some hams are salty, so that's up to you as well. But this recipe is in the cookbook, and if anybody has any comments, questions, or concerns, don't hesitate to reach out. And I hope everybody gives us a try and has a wonderful day.